This is 9 News Sunday Morning. Needed a big day out of Alexander Artemev from Highlands Ranch, as Mark mentioned when we talked to him in the 6 o'clock hour. Well, they got what they asked for. He delivered in the first ever Olympic competition for the Highlands Ranch young man. USA Today photographer Matt Dietrich took these photos, bringing in one of the best scores of the day on the pommel horse was Artemev over at 5280 Gymnastics in Wheat Ridge, where he practices. They call him by his nickname, Sasha. Dozens of young gymnasts gathered there last night to watch Sasha on national TV, and they invited our own 9 News reporter, Kyle Clark. Even at six, Christian Gidlin can tell you how to get to the Olympics. Yeah, you're supposed to be brave, brave from getting hurt and stuff like that. That's why you get good muscles. Sasha Artyomev showed him. I saw the pictures on the wall. He works out here, and his dad is um, is a coach for the older boys here. Doesn't make Beijing seem all that far. Um, we're gonna watch um, Sasha on the Olympics. I'm proud for him, and he's probably having a lot of fun. No, I'm happy that he made it, and I'm. Really hoping he does really good. They know exactly where the U.S. team needs Sasha to shine. He's really good at pommel. Even if they aren't the biggest fans of his best event. Only boys do pommel. He just has a lot of like strength and does a lot of just different things that you've never seen. And hopefully he does just what the judges want to see. They'll do the sign with their fingers perfect. Picture perfect. They're sending a picture to their friend in Beijing for luck and maybe for the record, in case any of these kids follow his Olympic footsteps. I've been working really hard, so I really hope I can. What's that? You don't think it can happen here? It already has. Who's to say it won't again? Because I'm brave. Kyle Clark, 9 News. Hey, that might be the next pommel champion. Yeah. All right, after his performance, Artem Ev told an Associated Press reporter that he escaped all that Olympic pressure by just blocking out the crowd. He actually said he pretended he was back at the Colorado State Championships. The Nine News Network, where news comes first.